They do, man. It's your boy Duck, man. Pipe. With another. Y'all know every time I come, I'm coming with it. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, man. You don't want to miss this sauce. And make sure you look below. You will see the link to our merch store. Everything y'all buy for our merch store, all proceeds goes back to the channel. And like I say, this is how we spread our message. And we getting that reach out, though. Okay? Thanks to y'all. Listen, let me show you just how our government be, be trying us. You know, acting like we stupid. You know, like I said in the song, you know, whether you black or white, don't get the shit confused. The government take all of us for a damn fool. That's facts, right? Now, I know quite, maybe y'all have seen this, but maybe you haven't, okay? You got what they call the FOIA Act. What is that? That is the Freedom of Information Act, right? Where there's, there's like some scientists and a couple professors and stuff came to the FDA and wanted information on the you know what the you know what I'm saying you can't you got to watch how you say stuff but yo what they told them in order for them to get that information which is under the FOIA what's that freedom of information act okay they said they're going to take it's going to they're going to need 55 years to give this information up 55 years are you serious? It ain't take them near that long to say, hey man, we need to we need to get y'all the whoop the whoop. Y'all know what I'm talking about. But people gonna hear this shit and act as if it don't mean nothing. This is how you control people. People don't ask questions. I mean, it common sense. That's all you need. Common sense. Now I'm gonna tell you another thing. And I've done a video about this a while back. And you got what they call the PREP Act, right? This is the PREP Act. Well, if anything happened to you, you know, during the time you go get the you-know-what, you know what I'm saying? That these companies have 100% immunity. Meaning, if something happened, that's just your ass, Mr. Postman. There's no compensation. There's no kickback. No nothing. You are 100% an experiment. And, oh, like I said, I did a video the other day about this goes for black people, white people, green, purple, blue. It doesn't fucking matter. Okay? It doesn't matter. And this should let you know that you can't be, you know, don't get too high on your high horse. Because if you're not a part of the bloodline, you will be sacrificed too. But I just said that to say this, how much fuckery will us, the people, take before we take action, before we speak on some some things? And like I said, go look it up for yourself. You can just go to Google and see this information. You can type in 55 years FDA, it'll pop right up. Some folks say they need 55 years to give up this, this public information. 55 years? Half of these motherfuckers are already 65 and 55. Half of them ain't gonna live to see the day that they're able to release that information. See, this is see when you allow people to govern you and you sit back and don't do nothing. And I ain't saying you as an individual, but I'm just bringing this to people's attention. We, when we sit back and don't do shit, this is what's gonna happen. This is how a small group of people can control a very large group of people. It's not rocket science. It ain't. But like I say, people just got just got to start thinking. That's really it. People don't think. People just do what they be told. Scared as hell. So patriotic. So this, so that. But all it takes is common sense. A fucking fifth grader can understand that there's some BS in the pudding. Me and tell me gonna take y'all that long to compile this information, but yet y'all rushed out and just say, okay, woo de woo. It's gotta be a big agenda. Like y'all gotta people gotta start thinking. When election time come, don't let them distract you, because that's all they do. Distract you with some shit over here so you don't know what's going on over here. That's how magic works. I keep telling you. When people do magic tricks, they make you focus on what they want you to focus on. When the real trick is happening somewhere else. But in this case, this shit happened right in front of our face. 
Like these people really be testing our intelligence. One minute we are the, and I be telling y'all, be weary of those words, words or spells. When they say shit like, we the people, our country, our great, this ain't our country, this ain't we the people. Like y'all know, like a lot of people know better now. You know what I'm saying? We know that some ain't right, and we know that, bro, stop trying to, you trying us like we stupid. But when you got so many people divided, it's hard to stop what they're doing because, like I say, some of this stuff don't apply to certain people, so they don't give a fuck. They going about their day until it knocks on their front door. So I be doing videos like this just to show people that color don't mean shit at a certain degree if you think. So, but we know it's racism. We know things like that happen. But if you think the bigger, bigger, bigger picture, these people don't give a fuck what color you are. So you can play that game if you want or feel as though you're privileged or feel as though you're going to, you know, it's a way bigger, bigger agenda, man. A lot of y'all understand where I'm coming from. That's why I don't do all that. But then again, as us as people, what about our children? They the ones going to really suffer or suffering. I think it's this. We need to tear this whole shit down and rebuild it. I'm all for civilization, but not this shit. This is not civilized. This is nothing. There's no equality. There's nothing but dictatorship. If you look at every movie, I just watched Free Fucking Willy yesterday. That's for some reason, you know, I search stuff, come on, you just go back to your childhood. Free Willy had a form of dictatorship in it. Homie didn't give a damn about Willie ass. He just wanted his million dollars to turn Willie in to get the, the insurance claim. While the little kid was trying to free Willie. Every movie, including Disney movies and all that, it has some type of form of dictatorship, some type of form of government, some type of form of ruling of other peoples. See, they use movies and stuff like that to keep that in our head. I told you, cognitive dissonance. Once you keep saying and doing something over and over in your head, your brain develops a certain type of truth to make you think that you're supposed to be naturally governed by other people that put their pants on the same way you do. And the only reason you think that way is because they control everything around you. They control the media. They control the food. They control the resources. Food, water, and shelter, they control all basic aspects of our lives. So, therefore, they can control a, a lot of people and finding very, I mean, finding ways to control us without force. That's the whole key to remotely control your ass. Remote control, you know, the remote control is to control something from afar. See how this shit clicks? I told you, when you open these, you can't close them. Once you open these, Anyway, I just want to drop that on y'all, man. You know what I'm saying? And um, just think about what I said. Think about it. Think about it, man. A lot of the shit we can stop. It, it, the power's in the people, bro. Power. Fuck a Gucci. Fuck a, all these big time companies. Man, these people don't give a damn about us, man. They're going to make it seem like what they selling is the best thing since shit's thing. But it ain't. You know what I'm saying? You was a gorgeous person, bro. You don't need all this bullshit to make you feel as though you are accepted or, you know. It's another video, though. That's another video. But I apologize because I be trying to stop cussing and stuff. But listen. Anyway, y'all go look those things up for yourself. Look up the PrEP Act. P-R. What is it? P-R-E-P. -E PrEP Act. Look up the PrEP Act. Look up the F-O-I-A Act. Okay, and you'll see for yourself. But the people who control this stuff, why you think they want to control it? Cause so they can dictate what happens and don't happen. This is why they fight for control. Why? Why you think they build in Walmart's, Walgreens? Cause they want to control what you consume. We coerced to go buy this shit. Man, grow, grow what you can grow in your backyard. Your grandma got some land, man. Go grow some stuff, man. Talk to your, to your tomatoes and your bell peppers and onions. You're supposed to build a relationship with your, with those. Those are plants. Okay, we vibrating through plants. We vibrating through everything. 
But they want to take that away from us. Right? I know I'm getting a little off topic, but they want to take that away from us and consume and put in there what they want to put in there so that we can consume that shit. That that's that's gonna furthermore give us more underlying illnesses later on in life. You know what I'm saying? I seen a documentary on Coca-Cola where I think it was Mexico. Mexico is the most country well, the country that consumes Coca-Cola the most. This is like a vice document. Everybody over there got diabetes. Everybody selling Coke. Coca-Cola, it's, it's, it's crazy. And I want to say it's in Mexico. It's one of those, I think I think Mexico. But they put shit in these things, these different additives and these different um, ingredients to make us uh, immune to it. Not, well, I ain't going to say immune, but make us crave it. And I told y'all, sugar is eight times more addictive than crack cocaine. But when I did that video, they took it down. I'm only trying to help us as a people, man. Don't give a damn about all this other stuff. Anyway, it's your boy Papa Duck, man. You know I love y'all. I want to drop that on y'all to get y'all using this. Use this at all costs. And watch what you say around your kids. Teach them to use this too. Don't teach them to just play, you know, all day and, you know, y'all get me. But anyway, man, like I tell y'all, man. It's your boy Papa Duck, man. You know I love y'all. Like I say all the time, man. In order for you to be found, you must first be lost. Okay? Like, comment, subscribe to the channel, man, if you haven't already. And thank you.